Good morning, good evening, good afternoon, good night. Whatever time of day this video finds you, it's Boy Jay here. We got two more weapon trailers to go over. One of them released yesterday. Today they released one. Today they're releasing one every day. Duh. But they are cooking, okay? Uh, oh my God, they're cooking, all right? That is enough preamble. I'm going to have plenty to say. Let's just go ahead and get Gunland started. Here we go. Let's fire it up. Oh, baby. Gunlance. Gunlance looks amazing. So that looks to be a charge shell, right? I'm loving the way this Gunlance looks. Bang! Bang! Hello? Excuse me? Oh, okay, 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 okay. Bet. Wow, wow, look at the side steps. And I think I think they hit both of those too. If you look closely, boom, boom. And then swat. That's crazy. Okay, so at first I was thinking. Well, this might be a full burst here, this sweeping, blah, 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 blah. but it might only be, well, then they reload, because that's what I was, I was thinking, I was like, shot, shot, swipe, one, one, two, I can't really hear, but maybe if it's like a normal gun lance and it has five slots, then maybe that was the rest of the full burst in the clip, oh yeah, and that's probably going to be an, an opportunity to full burst right there, look at this, Boom! Right? I, I play full burst playstyle. That's my preference, you know what I'm saying? I also used to play bullet barrage spam, but that's not going to be a thing here. That's full burst. There you go. And then... Boom. Still takes forever. I'm wondering if you can just let it go early or if you're stuck. And then the drill! This is insane. This is so insane. That's so crazy. Oh, man. Look at that, that's another like sweeping, see, it's, it, they did that a couple times throughout this trailer, it's like a sweeping full burst, or maybe it's, I don't even know how to describe it, this looks, oh, dude, I'm loving the drill, dude, and then a big back hop, you love it, and then, boom, and then look, that one is a bit more vertical, oh, so good, so good, we're gonna start that over, we're gonna start that over, it's just so sexy, it's just so good, and then with the charge with the charge shelling i'm seeing that you're doing it behind a shield i'm wondering what happens if you get interrupted while charging up a charge shelling do you just let the charge shell rip you know what i'm saying like, almost like a counter dude that's so fast that battle stick is so fast Row. hold this oh my god it's so good and then the reload boom okay hop back nice block and then big slap probably an opportunity for full burst there look at this so see that's uh, i'm thinking that's a charged shell but now you can charge it reposition and you have your shield up i'm wondering what happens if you get hit while you're charging it do you just let it rip and tank the hit or if you get hit while you're blocking you do the block and then whatever it's over go back go back full burst okay never mind that looks like a regular full burst and then wyvern fire Black out. Big shot. So then, drill time. That's so crazy. So crazy. I wonder if that will do more damage if um, you're waiting for your gun lance to cool down after a wyvern fire since it's hot, right? Anyway, but that's just me thinking. Look at that. That's so fast. That's, look, wyvern steak. Quick re is Wow, that's, that's a fast reload. Because we just... The clip is cut kind of weird. Okay, just inserted one. That is so insane. That is so fast. You could do so many wyvern steak. Back to back to back. Hold on, bro. Not the drill. Not the drill. Drilling. Going great. Love to see it. But this right here. Stab. Was that a reload? What is that? Quick reload? That's so fast. You could basically always have a stake in the monster at that point. Like, God damn, bro. Gunlance is cooking. Gunlance is looking great. Um, I didn't really pick up Gunlances until Sunbreak, and then I, I retroactively went back and played it in Iceborne and GU. Gunlance is mad fun, and that looks like fun, even though we don't have Blast Dash. So, hey. I was like, I can't imagine a world where we don't have Blast Dash, but I also couldn't imagine a world where Gunlance has a freaking drill. Man, I'm loving it. I'm loving what I'm seeing. 
I'm having a great time. Now, on to today's weapon. Oh my god. Hunting Horde looks so good. I was this was one of my top weapons to see like how many changes did it get? And oh my god, they cooked with this one. Let's go. I'm going to be talking and pausing the whole time. You guys know where to go to find these trailers, okay? Just go to the Monster Hunter official YouTube channel or the Twitter, and you can watch these uninterrupted. But if you're here, I'm assuming you're here for me and my commentary and what I add and to hit the comments down below and add to the discussion because I reply to those, all of those, at least once. So, yes, let's, let's let it rip. That's enough talking. Good God Almighty. Hunting Horn. Yes! Okay, so I've watched this a little bit, not as much as the Gunlance one, but I have questions as well. Love it. I love that they opened with a KO. Please do the same for Hammer. Look at this. Hold on, hold on. We already got a... I'm wondering, so... Hmm, I have, I have a lot of questions. Oh, this is incredible. Echo Bubbles. I, I'm loving this because this this kind of reminds me of a fusion of two of the Silkbine Arts we had in Sunbreak, right? This kind of reminds me of Bead of Resonance mixed with uh, Silkbine Shockwave, right? And you know, you know what I'm saying? Like, it's very easy to see how both of those Silkbine Arts became this. And now you can lay down a bubble and... It seems as if every time you play a note, you get a, a an echo, right? See the seven damage, seven damage. Oh yeah, and then boom! Look at this! Look at this! Boom! And if you look, if you look out here, where's my mouse at? Lord Jesus, where's my mouse at? Oh, my mouse all over the place. But if you look, go back. If you look out here, the the to the right, this one is missing because you know Balahar is not in it. But there are effects going off over here too. See? So I'm thinking if you are like really good at positioning these things or you know like a teammate is going to lay down a trap. Let's say you guys are playing on, on voice. Hey, bro, I'm going to lay down a trap. You start putting echo bubbles down to really like have all like because imagine if the Balahara was rotated 90 degrees, right? And the head, I'm going to pause the clip entirely. And the head was over here and the tail was over here. All of the echo bubbles would be hitting right and you the hunting horn user could be positioned over here and play the notes and get hits all throughout the entire body right of this leviathan the long slithery boy and i'm imagining snake wyverns are gonna make a comeback of some kind like i want najarala to come back because he's the only snake wyvern him and his subspecies along with some new ones maybe the flagship's a snake wyvern maybe we got a new invader high level one right and you can lay these bubbles down strategically you know let's say you got a homeboy sticking a trap right there you're like i bet i'm gonna throw down these echo bubbles and really get to jamming on that ass and dealing damage across the entire body of this huge monster think of something like um Durambaros, right Durambaros does the big spin bow lands and you knew he was gonna land you got these echo bubbles all set up and then you just start blah 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 blah, blah, blah. damage all over the place I'm I'm so excited. That's so fast. That's such a fast song. Boom. Hell yeah. And wow, the the effect is kind of it's kind of small, but you can see it. Very very small. And she starts to glow right here. Yep. Yeah, but that's so fast. Oh yeah, focus mode and mm, they brought this bad boy back. Oh, that's so good. That's so good, bro. Earthshaker is back, and it's better than it's ever been. You get to play a whole damn recital. That looks like the tenderized attack. Boom. More echo bubbles going crazy. What is that? Oh, my God. It's so good. It's so good. But I also still have questions, right? We're going to run the whole trailer back. And that's actually a second hunting horn. They have two hunting horns in this clip, by the way. And I wonder if they, they chose to change the hunting horn so that we can see a specific song being played, right? Look, this hunting horn is not the same as this hunting horn. We're seeing this, yes? Like, I'm not tripping. So I'm thinking this is this one has like a like an echo song, like... um the Iceborne Impact Echo song, and they wanted to see, look at, oh my god, look at that effect, bro. And they wanted to show us the Echo Mode song being played along with the Echo Bubbles, causing Valahara to, you know, 
have some grief. So, yes, looking insane, Hunting Horn looks insane. I have questions, though. I have questions. So here's the thing. Throughout the entire trailer, Hunting Horn looks amazing, right? But I'm not seeing any colors, right? Like, we're used to playing, you know, a melody, a song. No, but I don't see any colors. Did they take the colors out for this trailer? You know what I'm saying? Like, because usually, you know, one button press corresponds to one note. This corresponds to a different note. And then X and A corresponds to a different note, you know? Usually it's, you know, one's blue, one's red, one's green or something. But, you know, the colors can differ from horn to horn. But I'm seeing none of that here. So I'm very interested to see, like... It's just so different. It's just so different. And then also, uh, another thing I've noticed, I'm, I'm gonna run this back. Sorry, I'm gonna be annoying. Uh, I'm, I'm gonna run this back. I'm noticing that upon recital, let's see, right here, boom, boom. See, all of that, bing, bing, all of the bing. I'm wondering if all of those deal damage now, right? Because you lay down an echo, and even laying down an echo does damage, right? But let's see, that looks like a. Hold on. Playing notes. Okay, playing a song. Boom. Boom. See? So we got a we got a song, we got a recital. And and each time it, it's hmm. It's almost like um all songs have become echo mode from Iceborne, if that makes sense, right? So in Iceborne, you play the, you you know you you play the recital and if you got the echo mode loaded up, every time you finish the song, there would be an echo and it would be like a boom. Right, whereas other songs like Attack Up wouldn't have uh, uh, an effect. It would just buff everybody around you. You feel me? But in this one, what if all songs kind of have a little bit of an echo to it as well, as well as buffing other players around you? Maybe they made it a little bit weaker, but they gave that effect to every song so that you don't have to choose: Am I doing damage or am I playing songs? Right? So. Uh, uh, like the corner horner would be even less effective, right? Because, like, okay, your songs do damage too, bruh. Like, you ain't got to stand in the corner swing at nothing and just, just so you can play the songs. Because play the songs in the monster's ear because they're, they're doing damage too. I mean, look at this. Boom. Right? Is it all echo songs we're playing right now? Are we getting buffs? I mean, look at, look, look at our hunter. Like, he glows every time a song is being played. Glow. Yup. Boom. Glow, yup, we're glowing. So there's some kind of buff. There's no UI, right? So there's there's that part that's confusing as well. So look, boom, that glow, that yeah, and I think he glowed at the same time she glowed. Yeah, see, so passing on the buffs, but it also looks like, boom, that's that's a little a little. If you look at the horn when when he plays the song, mm, right, that looks like that's gonna deal damage while also passing on the buff so it looks like every song is gonna kind of have a little echo on it that sounds insane i'm so excited so 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 excited to play hunting horn here in wilds and i'm gonna be playing a lot of hunting horn right i mean i play with a literal child my son <laughs> so that's why like i'm so invested and in, uh i like playing hunting horn so much as a supportive type play style right if you go back and look at some of the father son hunts i pick horns specific to what i maybe feel his weaknesses are right or uh maybe i want to buff him up and make him stronger while still dealing damage on my own that's why i love hunting horn and supportive play style so much i literally play with my son and like yeah supporting is my thing when you know he's the star of the show so yes it's looking insane uh i can't wait i can't wait for this public demo to come out and you already know when that public demo comes out we're playing it like crazy we're probably gonna go to daily uploads then because i can i can you know on my day off i can play a bunch and then release those videos daily so definitely subscribe down below if you like monster hunter content and uh i reply to each and every comment that hits this video at least one time so jump in on the conversation tell me are there things that i missed in these two trailers are there things that you've seen that maybe i didn't see that you're excited for or did i point out something that maybe you hadn't thought of let me know in the comments down below and as always people happy happy hunting Peace.